hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss about how to convert the date time that you are getting from the database to the users time zone so you all know that the database inside the database the date time fields are stored in utc so currently here in the appointments model we have already added a field that is date time field you can see appointment underscore date time of type date time and in the screen you are seeing the value 10th sorry 15th october 2019 and the time is 17 hours and 30 minutes and if you access the same time inside the code suppose we have already a function here that is delete function so you can see the method is delete underscore lines and if i go to that corresponding function that is this is the function and i will just print the time that is rec dot appointment date time which is this field line so you can see rec dot appointment appointment underscore data so i'll just click on i'll just clear the log first i'll just make it this section empty and i'll just click on this delete button okay and if you check the log you can see you are getting the time as okay this is fine 2019 october 15 that's fine here we're also getting 2019 15th october and here you have seen time as 17 30 but here in the code you are seeing it's 12 hours there is a difference of 530 hours as far as my time zone is concerned so there is a need for which you have to convert that time into the user's time zone that is the, you have to get the same time that you are seeing in the front end inside your code so let's see how we can do that so here from here i'll just i have already added some codes and which i have kept as commented i'll just remove these comments and here you can see I just remove the comments in the code and i have already imported the package that is import pytz that python package is imported into the my file import pytz that's done and if i scroll down you can see first of all we have to get the time zone of user so user's time zone is that if i click on here and if i go to the preference here you can see the time zone of the user here my time zone is asia bar kolkata so that's done so i have to get the time zone of the user for that you can add this time user tz equal to pytz dot time zone self dot env context dot tz or self dot env user dot tz by doing this you will get the time zone of the user so i'll just print the time zone of my user print user tz okay that's done now i'll just comment this code as of now i'll just see what we are getting inside the user tz so i'll just go to the front end and i'll click on the delete button again and if you check the here you can see my time zone is asia bar kolkata that's coming so now i'll just uncomment the rest of the codes and in the next line what we are doing is that pytz dot utc dot localize and we have to specify which field we have to convert into the user center time zone so my field is rec dot appointment date time so that has been done and as time dot as time zone and specify the time zone so this specify user t set here and i have just printed the things here so let's see what we are getting right now so i'll go to the front end and i'll click on the delete button again okay and let's wait for that log so here you can see time in local time zone that is that's fine that you are getting here and the time is getting us 1730 which you are seeing inside the front end 1730 so earlier without converting into the local time zone we have got time in utc so time in utc is 2019 10 15 and the time is 12 hours but here we have got 1730 which is plus 530 that is the difference between utc and my time zone so this is the code you can use so i'll just remove the prints things i have added so that you can see the calls so we have added three lines of code that is three lines is three lines is import pytz that's done and you have to what is the delete lines function yeah it's here so first of all you have to get the user tz so user tz can we get from pytz dot time zone self dot env dot get tz or self dot env user dot tz so using this line you will get the time zone of the user then you have to convert it to the local time zone pytz dot utc dot localize you have to specify the field name which you have to convert into the local time zone and dot as time zone user so if you do this much you will get the time zone in you will get the time in users time zone which will you, you see in the front end so that's all about this video if you have any queries or if you have any doubts feel free to ping us 
in the YouTube comments or over the mail. Our email ID is odomates at gmail.com. Also, you can just refer the channel to your friends and ask them to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get notified regarding the upcoming videos. So that's all about this video. Thank you.